Very intricate parts. What? Father and I go back to 1986, so, you know, he... <coughs> Yes, a great time. Southern come from Manhattan's and all that. <laughs> when he was a drinker. <laughs> so we go down to the basement in our bar and we have a few snippers. And it's time to go upstairs to eat, which, which we do. And eventually he tells me as we go on in our journey, we've seen him at Magic Ori, we've seen him all over and they want to sit by Father Rookie. I see Father Rookie all the time, for God's sake. Somebody else sit next to him. I don't want to. Yeah, take advantage of that. Of our holy priest. I really call him the Pope. He has a, a hair dryer. He has a hair guy that takes care, chops his hair up. They do a shaving. They do everything for him. So as far as I'm concerned, he's the Pope. <laughs> <laughs> and he does a lot of great work there. The phone's constantly ringing. You want to go to confession to him? He never says no. Just shut the door. And as you go on, you. You get your penance and God help you. And so <laughs> everything else that goes along with the program. But uh, Father and I, we've seen him in Magigori with our leader, Colum. We're going into one of the, the only bridge that brings you into Magigori. At the time, we see Father walking with about four or five or six people. I say, hey, Colum, stop this, boss. Let's get, that, let's get on that Irish cat going by right now. So he stops the bus and we catch him with with his entourage as usual, you know. So we've always had a good relationship with Father. I don't know how you want to put it. No matter what we seem to do, Father Rook is there. And he's blessed our whole family and everybody else's family here. This isn't just me. It's everybody else, City Hall. First is gonna pull my chain, I know she will. <laughs> but uh, it's been great working for him. I don't work as much, much as Betty does. I come in occasionally now. You're the prayer support. <laughs> she says, you're coming in today? I said, well, I don't know. It all depends. we got to get there before Mass. So you say the rosary before Mass. That big rosary of yours with the beautiful medals on it? Yeah. That's your powerhouse <laughs> chain. <laughs> You got it. Oh my God. Magnificent. Mm. And you use it. We it's got Father Pio here. We got a little bit of everybody here. Of course, we had Mustandoni St. Anthony, and Italian's Master Anthony. But he's uh, been a great priest, Father. I'm ashamed of your outfit, though. Not even saying congratulations or whatever they got going. To me, that really burns me up. The young rookie over there has probably been bitching all day long. Ago. <laughs> Excuse my terminology, but it's right. Mm -hmm. So you don't want to say it, I'll say it. <laughs> it it's just, just, it just burns me. Mm -hmm. What else do you want to say, Bucks? Sit down. <laughs> 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 That's an Italian for you. That's a good He speaks from the heart. Now you see, we've been married for 57 years. Sit down. Like Father Rookie said, you've got the last word. Yeah, very seldom. It's amen because City Hall's got to talk yet. <laughs> thank, you thank you everybody for coming with us. Yeah, hey, Tony. Hey. Thank you, Tony. This great drone is tough for a father. It's, it's, he's a different ball game, I'll tell you. More priests should be like him, I'll tell you. Yeah. It's just amazing what we sit with. Yeah, Thank you good. and Betty again for this beautiful evening. I got another note. Oh. Now we're going to have a cake. I hope everybody saved a little bit room.